Everyone was affected by the war. Every corner of the world was touched. Are you all right? We're ready for you to cut the cake. Wow, these are incredible. Yes, it was uh, an incredible time. <laughs> you looked very handsome in that uniform. That's not me, that's Matteo. Oh, of course. I'm sorry, Dad, take as long as you need. No, no, it's okay, Tesoro. It's time I told you what happened to him. It was during our last battle together, just a few days after our 21st birthday. My brother's battalion had been ordered to capture a fort deep into enemy territory. I wasn't going with him. I was part of a special unit with a different mission. Our task was to support Matteo's battalion. We were a proud unit. We changed the war for Italy. The Arditi. While Matteo was pushing forward, I had to fight up the mountain and take out anything targeting his unit. Just hearing this story makes me worry for you. Don't worry. I was in a full suit of armor. Besides, the Aditi were proud volunteers. We would have done anything for Italy. A church was sitting at the base of the path. Enemy troops had fortified it. I had to fight them first.
were some foot soldiers. After that, the church would be ours. an artillery gun that was shelling us and Mateo's unit. I had to destroy it. And he was still heading to the fort? Right. I had to make sure he got there.
was one of the sweetest sights of the war for me. But there was no rest. I could see an anti-aircraft gun over the next ridge that was taking out our planes. And that was my next target. The gun was manned by Austro-Hungarian troops. I had to remove them before I could use the gun myself. Men were killed, our advance would be completely altered, and 
I would have lost my tail. After the first few went down, they started targeting me. I had to stand my ground. Safe behind your armor? Of course, of course. Nothing could dent it. <laughs> <laughs> 